Hi and welcome back to the channel. In this video I'm going to be sharing with you how I feed my girls medicine, both liquid and tablets. This could be a life-saving hack that you guys will find very useful in case your dogs get sick, much like what happened with Bailey. And if you guys are interested in that, then please keep on watching. So there are many ways to do this and the most common ones are wherein you would mix the medicine to their food and there are some where you will hide it in like a piece of food which if it works for you by all means do it but there are times that some dogs will just you know they're just too smart and they can figure out what you're trying to do much like this little girl over here it's very difficult to feed her medicine which is why this hack was what saved me the easiest way to do it is you can you can do it slowly if your dog is not comfortable with it if they're not willing to take it without you holding their fur in the chin so I usually hold it like that and then I use my hand to open her mouth and then you push push it all the way back and then sometimes they will vomit that so what I would suggest you do is you blow their nose that will force them to swallow okay. there she swallowed so blowing on your dog's nose instigates their natural behavior to swallow, making it easier for both you and the dog to force feed the medicine to them. Another way, if your dogs can't handle it, what you can do is this method. You feed them from the back, toss it aside like that, and then blow. Alright, so let me show you how I get to feed them tablets without problems. So this is one of her antibiotics. So what I do is I try to open her mouth and then put the tablet as far close to her throat as I can without of course choking the dog, right? Okay, and then I close her mouth and blow on her nose. That's it, she's forced to swallow it. So I hope the hack will help, and I honestly pray that you would never find any use for it. Well, except for maybe vitamins and supplements. But other than that, I pray that you will not go through, you will not be forced to have as much medicine that I used to give Bailey. That's the least that I would want for any one because <laughs> it's tough. But you know, life goes on, and we just have to accept things as they are, and work around it. So I hope that helped, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye!